Naginata is yet another martial art. But what makes Naginata different from all the rest is it's the only Japanese martial art developed by women for women. Here's the scoop. The other unusual thing is that you have to shout out which part of your opponent's body you're going to aim for. Mrs. Homer is a Naginata teacher and she took me to her local park in Tokyo to teach me some of the basics. Oh no! Okay. Snap! 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 The main areas you aim for in Naginata are men, men. face, tsuki, Skip. the neck, do, ah. the stomach, kote, the wrists and sne. The shins. Originally, the naginata was a samurai warrior's favourite weapon. But when guns were invented, they were so effective that the more traditional weapons weren't used anymore. So they were hung up as ornaments in the warrior's homes. Women suddenly found there was a spare weapon lying around the house. And they started to train with it for fun. Over the next few hundred years, it turned into a women's martial art. Today, Naginata is becoming as popular with girls as Judo is with the boys. Sensei Nakazawa is a fourth dan in Naginata. She's been studying it for over 50 years. And of course, this being the scoop, I'm expected to fight her top student, Ayumi, after only half a day. and something tells me she's not very ladylike with a stick. In competitions, the bamboo naginata is used like the real one would have been by samurai warriors. You attack as though you are going to cut or slice your opponent. When defending, you block or deflect the blows, which is what I need to concentrate on if I'm going to stand any kind of chance against Ayumi. Putting on the body armour is a lengthy process, but I am expecting to be walloped a lot, so I need protection in all the places that you get points for hitting. Hiya. And Ayumi was taking it pretty seriously. Well done. Thanks. You must have had a good teacher. Yes, yeah, Sensei Kurosawa. She was excellent, but she was so strict. You had to learn how to bow properly to her and everything. But I think because I took it seriously, she warned me. And actually, it's the first sport I've ever been any good at in my whole life. And she said she'd teach me if I ever go back to Japan. Oh, that's so cool. I noticed throughout that whole story, you didn't have a stunt double once, mm -hmm. which is more than could be said for those wimps who play James Bond. <laughs>